hey you guys and welcome back to my channel today we're gonna be making this super cute three-tier DIY gondola I think they call it and of course it's gonna be Christmas edition because it is the Christmas season so we're gonna start with my DIY toolbox kit that I built and it's literally all from the Dollar Tree there's a video on it linked below and then this is going to be my painting material and these are going to be the items that I'm using to actually build the three-tier gondola. So now that we have our materials, let's get started. I'm going to begin with just wiping all of the hard surfaces down with some alcohol or acetone and that just kind of gets all of the dirt and grime and like film off of it so that your paint will hold nicely. As you can see, I'm going to do all of the pieces that I'm going to use to make my three-tier gondola. And then right here you'll see that I kind of, I don't know why I spent so much time on this, you guys, because after I painted it and glued it, you had no idea that there was a sticker under there, but I just had to get the sticker off and it took forever. <laughs> Now that that's done, I'm going to go ahead and get my paint. I've got this white chalk paint. I absolutely love chalk paint. It's just so smooth and rustic. And then I'm going to get my black paint as well, which I lost the footage of, but I just went ahead and painted a thin layer of black paint around each of the sides of the plates. So here you can see that I'm painting. And to be honest with you guys, it has been so long since I painted something that I totally forgot how to paint. And I spent a lot of time just playing in the paint. And it was just so therapeutic, you guys. It was such a great way to spend the afternoon. I had nothing on my mind but just this calm and patient feeling of working on arts and crafts. So I'd recommend this to anybody who struggles with anxiety or depression. It really feels good to take your mind off of whatever's going on and just focus on your paintbrush and the sounds of nature. As you can see, I'm sitting outside on my patio, which I would recommend doing arts and crafts outside. You can see that I have a board you really are going to make a mess, so just try to contain it as much as you can. <laughs> and just enjoy yourself. Bring life to something beautiful with your bare hands, and just be proud to be alive today. I did want to mention what I'm painting on. It's not an actual board board. It's cardboard. It was a box for something that we purchased and I just cut it up and saved a little piece for me to paint on top of. So it would be a great idea to save a big box, get you a little safety net so that you don't get paint all over your driveway or your patio or wherever you plan to do these arts and crafts. I haven't introduced myself yet so if you're new here my name is Brooklyn and I just want to welcome you to my channel for the first time and say thank you for stopping in and watching this video if you liked it could you please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you really really liked it and would like to see more or have any ideas of things that we could build together drop a comment below I love to sit and read through comments and just to get social with you guys I love connecting so let me know what you guys think about my channel and please 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 if you like it hit that subscribe button become part of my YouTube family here that I'm hoping to build I know it's been a long time coming but I want to say that I'm here to stay <laughs> if you'd like to pop over and follow me on Instagram my tag is Brooklyn Renee and that's spelled R-E-N-A-Y-E and here she is. This is after a couple hours of drying, so I'm just going to go ahead and grab my E6000 and I'm going to start gluing. Here I'm just going to put a little bit of glue on the top or the bottom of the first layer and I'm just going to build my way up from there. I have truly enjoyed sharing this DIY with you guys, so 
I'm gonna get the last layer up on top. I'm gonna let that glue dry and then here it is. Our finished product. Now how about we decorate her? Let your heart be light From now on Our troubles will be out of sight Have yourself Isn't she a beauty? Alright you guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you in my next video.